another question came in about how you discuss with your patients um, racial or ethnic disparities in GI diagnosis and care. So is this something that you feel is helpful to directly address with your patients in the case that um, your patient is a racial or ethnic minority and may not be, um, and that may be affecting their interactions with the medical system? Is this something um, that you, you bring up with your patients? And if so, how would you do that? Um, I'll just start to answer this, this question. Um, so I would probably be reluctant to kind of raise it as a topic. Um, first of all, I wouldn't want to, you know, presume that uh, just because someone is of color that this is something they're um, concerned with or thinking about. Um, I will say that that patients have brought it up with me. And what I tend to do in those situations is, is try to listen and um, validate, you know, as I would do with, with many um, struggles. Um, and, uh, you know, I think what I try to communicate, they, they feel like I get what they're saying as best as I can, you know, as, as a white person too, right? Uh, I can never really uh, understand, but um, I think just kind of nodding, listening, acknowledging, um, it can be tricky, you know, you, to get too sucked in because they might be talking about a colleague or, you know, those issues are always complicated when you're doing GI behavioral health, working in a system, but as much as possible, trying um, to validate. Yeah, Thank you. I, they, go yeah, ahead. I'm sorry. Um, so again, I agree with Jessica. It's certainly not a question that I ask, but I think through my assessment and exploration of just like what the illness means, how has this experience been for you? Very generalized questions. You can get a sense. Um, sometimes it'll come out. Some sometimes it won't. They still may be on like trusting of me, so that they they you know haven't they don't put their guard down yet um but if they start to discuss things again you know validate um listening but then to also maybe see if they're open to trying to find other ways of seeking other medical treatment with someone else if that's a possibility so it really depends where that person is how open they are with you um and if there's a if there's a possibility that they um would want to trust someone else you know to re to be able to go to another medical provider i don't know if that's even a, like po possibility but through exploration of what this what this means to them is somehow sometimes when some of these other issues do come up if that's is helpful absolutely thank you both you know it sounds like Maybe in some cases, if there's the opportunity for a better racial or ethnic match in terms of patient and provider, you might help the patient understand what that means and advocate for that if it's available. But the, the broader approach is listening, validating that experience and really understanding where the patient is coming from and how that has impacted their care to date. 